just I've remembered who it was with a bit of help from Google. It was a wonderful book by Ranald Fiennes about Scott. Yeah. We've, we've only, uh, Neil, we've only got a couple of more minutes. I just want to ask you about another story today, and I hope I'm not uh, bouncing you into this, but it's this story uh, which I think will interest you, uh, Nicola Sturgeon, First Minister's decision to offer a posthumous pardon or a, an apology to uh, Scottish witches who, getting on for 500 years ago, uh, were executed or burned at the stake. As an historian, what do you make of that? Well, I, I find it I find it bizarre um, the the timing of it. I suppose when there's when there's so much going on in the world of the living, uh, you know, to be to be dedicating time and uh, and whatever to, to events from centuries past seems bizarre. It's it's also strangely at variance with. Um, you know a, a lot of things that, are, that have been going on with with the Scottish government and and women's rights and and women's identities. Uh, I, I don't know. It, it feels a little bit of clutching at straws to be offering apologies to 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 women and men, of course, wronged all, all of those hundreds of years ago. Uh, it's I've said before, and I'll probably hear myself saying it again that there's so much that needs to be addressed in Scotland, health. Life expectancy, education, industry. Uh, there's there's so much that that needs that needs to be focused upon in the worlds and the lives of the living. Uh, and and to take time out at the moment when there's so much stress and anxiety in the east, uh, to to uh, offering apologies to, to to people who were mistreated and put to death in that way, I find very very bizarre. But I find a lot of what the SNP do very very bizarre. Neil Oliver, good to talk to you. Thanks a lot.